Hey guys, welcome back to Adventure Camp and Tactical Nut here. And today we're here to talk about the bare butt hammock and tarp system. So stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen, first what I'm gonna do is gonna set these up so you can see what the hammock looks like um, all by itself first. If you just get the hammock on its own, it will come with these uh, nylon ropes. Uh, but my buddy, who was kind enough to let me borrow this so I could check it out and see what I think of it, um, also got the, what we call the Kodiak straps, which they're like these nylon straps that go around the tree, which make it far easier to set up. Um, and of course, is better for the tree because it's not going to dig into it. Um, and then what I'm going to do is set the tarp up after that, and so you can see what it looks like over it. And then I'll kind of bring you in on what I think of both of them and how it works. And so stay tuned, let me get this set up and we'll get right back to you. All right, so as you can see here, I got a setup that literally took about a minute uh, because these straps make it so easy uh, to string it around a tree because you're not tying anything. So let me bring it a little bit closer so you can see what I'm talking about here. Um, what you get, you got the really heavy duty carabiners that it comes with. Uh, all you're gonna do is run this through its own self uh, to tighten it down onto the tree and as you can see here you have these little looping points and they're here 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 so they keep going down and of course any excess you can just let hang uh, or tie it up if you needed to uh, you got very heavy duty nylon right here you do have hopefully you can tell let's do it this way maybe triple stitching so that you know you know you're going to get some good durability out of it um i think these hold up to 400 pounds uh if that is incorrect i will ant annotate it in the description below uh here's your stuff sack that is connected just like most hammocks and of course they're a little let's go that way snapchat logo there um but yeah now i will look up the length of the tarp and of course annotate it down below along with the type of nylon that it is made out of um, but as you can see real quick and easy to set up let me get into it to show you some perspective on the size now I'm 5'9 150 pounds I will say that the guy that let me borrow it he's like 6'3 and 270 and he said he felt like it was a little small for him but for me this is perfect and it's really comfortable um, so definitely no complaints with that there. But as you can see, plenty of distance for me, laying diagonally or straight, depending on how you like to lay. If you're the type that likes to cocoon yourself in it, you can, because uh, it is plenty of width for someone my size. Um, but like I did say, the guy that let me borrow it, he's a rather large guy. Uh, he's a police officer as well. Um, so uh, he just felt like it was a little, little bit short for him but I think for lots and lots of people, this is going to be an excellent size. Um, now, what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna go ahead and string up the tarp, put it together, and then we'll discuss it a little bit more. All right, so now hopefully you can see, got it all staked out. We got the bare butt logo. I just carved a couple of tent stakes to be able to stake this down. Um, it does come with uh, guy lines for it, so that's always a nice bonus to have. Uh, I typically carry a lot of paracord, so um, that's what I use for the ridge line and stuff. Uh, but as you can see, it does cover about a foot and a half, probably, on each end past your head and feet. So should give you pretty good weather protection, definitely stuff falling out of the trees. Um, I know, like a lot of times when I go camping, uh, sometimes you kind of just don't want uh, something over if it's really hot during the summer or something because you want more wind but a lot of times this is a good way to go one just in case it rains because we always know the weatherman's always wrong um, and two stuff falling out of trees because if you're in the woods a lot you'll know that there's constantly stuff falling out of the sky or out of the trees and so having this to protect you um, once again I'll annotate what the material is that this is made out of but it is really lightweight it does feel really good quality. It is triple stitched as well, or no. This is double stitched, but it does have reinforcement around the grommets, which there are four of those. So let's take you in and 
show you how it's reinforced here. Uh, so yeah, should get a lot of durability out of that. And like I said, should give you really good protection from the elements, depending on, you know, if it does rain or if it doesn't. Uh, but I really like this system. I'll annotate what the prices are down below as well. Uh, so happy, my buddy. Let me uh, get this to be able to review it because I've been looking at a lot of hammocks. Um, if you saw my last uh, Karen box review, you saw that I did get one in it, but that's why <laughs> I didn't, couldn't remember the specs on this one because I've looked at so many. Uh, but yeah, I think this is a great way to go. It's a small business, so definitely give them a, uh, a try. Uh, they are a small company, so there are, and I am gonna say this, I have heard and from the guy that got this uh, problems with keeping some stuff in stock but I, in a lot of ways, that's probably a good thing because that means that they're doing a lot of business and we really like to see that. But yeah, guys, I think this is a great option. If you're looking to hammock camp, it is my preferred method of camping. It is the most comfortable way to sleep for sure. I mean, it keeps you off the ground, out of the elements, away from the bugs on the ground. They do offer bug nets as well. So something else to consider. And I definitely recommend getting the straps. Uh, those are extra, but they make setup and take down so easy. It's just crazy. Um, just to kind of give you an idea of how quickly you can take it down, you're just going to undo the buckle here, let that go, run the strap off the tree, and you can roll it in and start rolling it up until the stuff sack. So, yes, definitely easy setup and take down, uh, and of course, better care for the tree. But, all right, guys, hopefully, this will help you in your purchasing decisions of a new hammock system. Definitely think this is a good way to go, guys. And in the meantime, be prepared, have fun.